is just a peppercorn, man. This is super peppercorny. Wow. I like it. I mean, the flavors are awesome on all this. It really blends together right. Yeah. The bacon just adds an extra, like, kick to it. Right. Hi, I'm Jay, and I'm fat. I'm Jay, and I'm also fat. We are Two Fat Jays. <laughs> All right. Welcome back, everybody. We're doing another Two Fat Jays. And we're coming at you live on location. Except we're not live. And I'm not on location. But he is over here. I'm in the city of Anaheim. <laughs> Which I'm in the city right of my house. <laughs> right across the streets of Fullerton, California. Okay. I used to live uh, in Huntington Beach, so not far off. Where there's a Sonics. I have three around me, um, all within like five minutes. I don't know why. We have like way too many fast food places. I, I, I think I can't hit like a Burger King. Uh, I mean, let me say this again. I think I can hit a Burger King by throwing a rock, like no matter which direction. <laughs> like that's how close they are. Yeah, not out of here anymore. I mean, they're out of here, but they're not, they're not close. Yeah, well, we, we definitely don't need another Burger King here. Um, luckily... Uh, other things have been coming in, like uh, Whataburger and all that. So, anyway, um, I saw a commercial for this at Sonic, the bacon peppercorn cheeseburger. I think that's what it's called. Yep. And it looked pretty good, and I'm a fan of peppercorn. And there it is. It's not not the biggest thing, but. Uh, oh. You get the sandwich and a small tots or fries, and it's only three ninety nine. Like that's Cheap. not a bad deal. Yeah. Uh, what else did you get, Jay? I got me a mini shake. Hold on, let me grab it. A mini Ooh. strawberry shake. And how much was that? That thing was uh, three eighty nine. And I got me some. Uh, these look delicious. Their little uh, chicken nuggets, uh, honey barbecue flavored. I'm oh, yeah, yeah, those are good. I'm on site, so I'm, I'm looking right at the sign. What's it called? Popcorn chicken. Yeah. Nice. And I got the same combo. I got a corn dog. I got a foot long coney chili cheese. And I got a large cherry slush. I got my drink at McDonald's right up the street. Oh, there you go. It was cheaper. My large cherry slush was two ninety nine. My foot long coney was four ninety nine, and the corn dog was one seventy nine. Definitely not reasonable here. Yeah, it's not too bad. I mean, all this. And this is my first time. Uh oh, first timer! You know what that means? <laughs> 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 Nothing. <laughs> I think we need to make something up for like first time thing, like you you got to do the the titty thing. <laughs> well, uh, let's see. No, oh. first timer right here. Let's we'll see your titty. I'm gonna test drive this sucker, man. All right, go down. Good girl. Yeah, you don't need to see my food all the time. Wait, wait for it. Bacon. Bam. Yeah. Uh, mayo or ranch. You got the cheese on the one side, cheese on the other. Yeah, peppercorn ranch. So Peppercorn ranch, okay. That's actually quite good. $3.99, man, for that and this? Come on. We'll you see. don't find a deal like that anywhere. I can see on the menu, which is actually right over here, they got a chicken club toaster on the same type of bread, six eighty nine. 
This is what they call Texas toast. Yeah, it is thick, so. It is pretty good. Um, I just had one of these, man. These things are the bomb right here. Yeah. What is this? Honey barbecue popcorn chicken. Dang. They put a lot of bacon on this. Get my mind. All right, this thing right here was, they go by ounces of what he said. Like, how many pieces you get? Because got two sizes. He said they go by ounces, man. This is five ounces for uh, six seventy nine in his little nuggets. Their tots are always good, too. Actually, I haven't had one yet. Let's see. I'm not really a potato guy, but tots are better than all potato man but yeah i like tots better than fries in a way but i think this is the only place that you can get like regular tots i mean some fast food places have little nuggets of hash brown but um not in the best neighborhood though well all you're in your car all kinds of zombies walking around over here <laughs> They're all heading back to whatever this little weird Testoni Center is back here for a car, but it's a weird spot back there everybody keeps going to. But this is the closest uh, Sonics from uh, Disneyland, actually. I just came out of Disneyland. Yeah, you recording? Yep. On an action cam because I didn't bring a battery for my other camera. It is a bomb, man. I'd come back here for this. Whoa. Yeah. The peppercorn sauce is pretty good. Oh, yeah. They didn't put a lot on mine. Oh, yeah, they did. It's on. Yeah. This thing's awesome. I mean, there isn't any of these really around me, but I mean, I've never been here to push the button, do the concept, to do the order right here. I don't know if you walk in. Can you walk in? Some some have that. Some just have a window. Um, usually there's like a one of the ordering signs like at the stall up front. And you can sit down up front and just order. So I'm kind of thinking at this one because it's literally a drive-in. There's some seating like in front of me. Yeah. But I think you push the button over there and then you can order and they come to your table, I guess. But it did look like there was yeah, a yeah. place to like go in. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think I don't think you can go in. This is like a super dope one. But uh, yeah, this is pretty good. I, I don't know how long it's going to be around, but it's not um, even like advertised anywhere on this one. Luckily, you sent it to me, so I could say, "Hey, I'm looking for what we just ordered." So yeah, I had to ask too, but it's on their website. They also have these little. Um, what do you call them? They're little buffalo chicken balls. I think you get like three, five, or seven pack. Well, they're limited time as well. They're they're like different from yours because they're like um, kind of um, got batter around the outside. But I don't like buffalo chicken flavor. Like I don't like that sauce. You're saying they have it here? Yeah. I'm looking. Soft pretzel twist looks good. What else they got? I see jumbo popcorn chicken. I see chili cheese tots. Uh, crispy tender dinner. What is it? What was it? I'm gonna I'm gonna bring up a photo here. Shake is delicious. <laughs> So this is what it was. Buffalo chicken dip bites. All right. Let's see. You can get a three, five, or seven pack. It might not be up there because it's a, it's a limited time. Yeah, no. yeah, it's not up there. They look like mini empanadas with the buffalo chicken all wrapped up inside and cheese, I guess. Yeah. They're probably good. Cheddar cheese 
battered together with the buffalo chicken. I mean, they're probably good. I just don't care for the buff- buffalo tangy sauce, you know? Like, I, I no, mean, no, no, no. it's all right, but it's not my favorite thing. So I don't no. tell them to go for it. But I'm sure they're probably good. But if they have barbecue, man, I'd be all over that shit. Um, not too many places have peppercorn stuff. I don't know if you ever went to Quiznos when those were open. Uh, like a Subway? Uh, I'm sure they, I know they had them out of here, but I don't think I went to them. And they, they had a peppercorn uh, like steak sandwich. It was so good. I used to get it all the time. Since you said the peppercorn, man, this is super peppercorny. Wow. Oh. I like it. I mean, the flavors are awesome on all this. It really blends together right. Yeah. The bacon just adds the extra, like, kick to it. Right. I'm looking at the prices, man. They're not expensive on any of this. Hmm. Just don't live by one. Well... Now you have two more places, Chick Fil A and Sonic. All right, so down the street, going that way, I hit up thrift shops here and there. There's a Salvation Army I'm gonna hit up after this, but I'm over there a lot. I might as well just roll over here and get my grub every once in a while. That was good. Pots are good. Yeah. Crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside. It's awesome. They give it a ketchup, though. Usually it's in the bag. Ketchup, mustard, and salt. Well, I see salt, a fork, and two pieces of candy. Hmm. Usually they put it in there, but. Is this their thing? Yeah, it's their thing. Does they give you a bad breath or what? No, it's just something extra. The corn dog, not much different from a uh, wiener schnitzel corn dog. Had them before. Corn dog. How much is a corn dog? Corn dog is two forty nine over here. Hmm. One seventy nine here. Chili cheese, Tony. Is that what you got? The foot long. The foot long. Five fifty nine over here. Four ninety nine. Damn California. Here we go. Damn. Yeah, it's actually sticking outside the bun on both sides. Like a Dodger dog, man. Is the chili good or what? It's okay. There's nothing special about it. The shredded cheddar or what? Yeah. I mean, it's good, but when it comes to chili, like the Wendy's chili has a beat for sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, if you want to put that kind of chili on a hot dog, though. Oh, um, no, but. but. Yeah, no, yeah, Wendy's chili is the best. Standard chili. Get it at the store. Not a big deal. Is but, meat? Is there beans or what? Nothing like that or um looks like it's all beef. No beans. Not bad, not bad. I mean it's good. Don't get me wrong. It it works with their their hot their hot dog, but just saying there's better chili out there. So. Dude, these things are the bomb right here, man. Yeah, I, I've gotten those before. I get this all the time. Sometimes if I just want a snack, I'll go get a corn dog with the tots. So. I'll definitely be back when I'm doing my uh, thrift shop uh, circuit around here. I'm like, man, these are awesome. Do you find any more... Um... <laughs> Fat pigs and sumo wrestlers. 
actually, uh, I guess there's a gas station around here that was doing a anniversary and they had golden pigs like those with their logo on. That was weird. Why would they want to give that out? Huh. <clears throat> I didn't buy one, but I thought I saw them. There's a toy somewhere, but it's the same pig. Oh, yeah, there's an actual toy out there of those things. It just seems weird that there's one gas station. Go, oh, our 50th anniversary. Oh. Let's make some big, fat, golden pigs with a logo on it. I think it was a dog toy. Somebody had them as a, yeah, as, a, as like a dog toy. Which makes sense. Right. As long as the thing don't pop out and choke them. Shake time. Well, a lot of those dog toys have a squeaker. So. Yeah, but the one I got, thing sticks out. I don't know why. I tried to put it back in the mouth, but it, it, I don't think it really goes in the mouth all the way in. That's what Good she stop. said. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you opened yourself up for that one. That's what she said, too. It did. America's drive-in, man. Except for here in California. A bunch of these things are everywhere across the United States. Yeah, they didn't come out west until a bit later. It's like Dairy Queens, man. They're not big out here. They're probably huge other states. We actually have them out here. Yeah, but... uh. Dairy Queen Chillin' Grill, or whatever it is, by me. Food looks disgusting, though. It's okay. It's the same company that runs um, Orange Julius. Which, those all went out around here. We have them in the mall. They're, like, together. Double Orange Julius and um, yeah, the only one I knew was in the Westminster Mall, and that Orange Julius went out. Not enough people going to a mall. No, no mall survives. Nope. That mall was crap back when I lived there, and that was over twenty years ago. Yeah, they put a Target in there now. Sears bailed out. JC Penney's is still there. They put on a Target. And they do the Halloween stuff there. The, wait a minute. Yeah, they do in the old Sears building. Yeah. I gotta check into that. I think Adam went there last year. Yep. I didn't even know about it. Yeah, I gotta check into that. Now's the time. You better contact him. <laughs> He's out here. Yep. All right. So we established this is pretty good. We're gonna come back, and I've been back many times. What do you rate everything? All right. So that burger. I miss delicious. I say eight. The nuggets I just finished, man, are ten. And that shake right there, that was delicious. That's probably at least eight or nine. The tots are just, they're good. They're just tots. Wow. Standard tots. But my Coke Zero from McDonald's? That's a 20, man. <laughs> I'll agree. Um, the peppercorn sandwich, it's up there. Seven or eight. I, yeah, maybe eight. I'll go eight. The bacon's awesome on that. Slushies, can't go wrong. Um, it's a regular slushy. But Speaking of slushies, man, they have three different slushies over there at the Mickey D's. Any size, 150. They don't come this size, though. 
Uh, no, but that's 44 ounces probably right there. This is the large. You actually can get a bigger one, the 44. Oh, that's what, 32 then? 32. So this, it's not on the menu anymore, but they have cream slushes, which is like this with ice cream in it. Well, I don't know what that'll taste like. I mean, is it good? But if you did that, yeah, it's good. Being out here in the summertime, we should get them all the time. Oh, I bet, man. Arizona's. Yeah. You say it's raining right now? Yeah, it's stopped now, but it was like it's monsoon season. Shit comes and goes. Big lightning storm, thunder. And like people are like, oh, I can't drive. Yeah. Nice and sunny over here, man. It's it's well, it's not sunny again, but it's not raining anymore. So, sure. If I looked off behind me at the mountains back out that way, you just see the big white puffy clouds, man. You know, there's like uh, thunderstorms going on back there, but yeah, Coney, it's nothing special. I'll give it about five, probably uh, four for the corn dog. I mean, they're not great, but they're they're edible. You know. If, if you want to eat something, they're decent. The dang dog, man. Hot dog, that's freaking huge. Wow. 559, man. He says cheaper yours, but 559, 989 for uh drinking tots with that hot dog. I'm looking at the menu, man. It seems all right. I like to try the chili cheese tots, I would assume, because small ones only 379, just a test drive it. Burgers just look like standard burgers, though. Yeah, nothing special. It's like Burger King. I'm definitely coming back and grabbing some of those uh, honey barbecue popcorn chicken again, man. Those I'm like the big pack. Seven sixty nine over here. They also have breakfast burritos, which is pretty good too. Yes, yeah, it's premium burrito, supersonic or. Ultimate meat and cheese, only five thirty nine. Then they got these little cinnamon, cinnabon, cinna snacks, cream cheese frosting that it comes to dip it in. Looks like puff pastry with like cinnamon inside. Of what it looks like. Yeah, probably some of those uh, buffalo chicken bites, maybe. The other good thing with them, um, kind of like checking a box, is their menu is available all day. Oh, seriously? You mean the breakfast and everything? Mm hmm. They got a two, three, and four dollar menu I can see over there. Yeah, and a lot of times they have happy hour where their drinks or like shakes and stuff are like half price or whatever. So it depends. Quarter pound double cheeseburger, $3.99. Dang. Yeah, they're pretty cheap. But, I've never know, been to one. <laughs> I've passed this place so many times in life, but I, I never stopped. Yeah, they they used to come out on roller blades to your car. Some of them still do it, but well, I bet you somewhere out there in some state that's probably all they do. But here, yeah, yeah I could picture. It. I mean, it's set up to do that, but now they just walk out. They just come out with a like one of those things that you almost would put on the side of the car, but. Yeah, just yeah. for them to hold it and hand you your bag. Oh yeah, they kiss the bag. Oh, love you, Sonic. Somebody wants some. Did you not get any Sonic? Mm -hmm. Did I eat it all? Because I'm quiet. I'm quiet. Carhop Markel is the person that gave me my food. <clears throat> and I even tipped I tipped them too because is that what you do? At a bad food joint? You know, I don't know, man. I gave him a couple bucks. That's fine. But honestly, I mean, they're just walking out with your food. They're already eating. Yeah, I know. I don't understand the whole tipping to people. Like he is even the pizza guy, he's already getting paid. It's not my fault you don't pay them enough. Don't blame it on me that I don't tip them. And like DoorDash, I, I got to tip your DoorDash, dude? No, sorry. 
I, I, I mean, used to drive Uber, not get tips. That's something you would tip for, like a taxi. Like, I understand that. If you're just bringing me, bringing me food, I'm, no, dude, you don't get a tip. I don't understand that at all. Stupid. I didn't know the etiquette for this place. Like, I gave him two bucks. Yeah, well, I mean, it's fine, but I'm just I saying. I mean, it's like a fast food joint. It's just they brought it to me, but yet it's a fast food joint. You don't usually tip at fast food places, but I've never been here. No, I mean, that's, you know, that's fine. That's your, your what do you call it, your prerogative or whatever. But if you, the guy at McDonald's tells you to go wait out over there because the drive food was too busy or whatever, and they were going to come bring you your food, are you going to tip that guy? Like, no. You know why they're doing that? To save their asses. Because there's a time stamp of you, when you pull up to the window, inside there's a timer going, and then to save their asses, they'd say, hey, man, can you pull over to the front or pull off to the side? You know what really kissed me, though, is, is like a lot of times this happens where the guy ahead of me takes like half an hour and then I get there and they tell me to go up, like to go wait. Like, why didn't you tell that other fucking guy to go over? I, I, like, my food's probably cold now. <laughs> like, I don't understand that how that works at all. Yep, it doesn't make sense. But, yeah, know. Well. On location, much. Yeah, pop this <laughs> off here real quick. So you got a little clip for your steering wheel? Well, well no, it's right here. Oh, you got that. Okay. Cool. Sonic. Sonic. Press that red button. And they'll take forever to try to get your order. There's uh, Lemon Street here in the city of Anaheim. And then right across the street, we see that yellow truck just drove by. That's bullets on the other side. Look at my uh, headliner. <laughs> <laughs> You shouldn't take your cat in your car. <laughs> That's it. Look at that. Your cars are known for uh, whatever they use. It just gets destroyed. Oh, yeah. Well, and it's an older car anyway. So, yep. The fact they don't even make them anymore. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Are you still oh. there? What? What did you do? Uh-oh. Am I still there or what? You're there. There you are. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what I did. I thought <laughs> when I put the clip in, I think it hit the off button, or, but that was weird. Mm. I was going to say, um, I dare you to press the button, and when they answer, just say, I'm fat. I'm, oh, yeah. Hot. <laughs> no. I'm fat. <laughs> just Hot, I'm fat. I just ate your food. <laughs> Can I get another uh, 40 pack of the uh, uh, popcorn chicken honey barbecue, please? Man, those things are awesome. Just be like, if I eat five more of those, will you give them to me for free? <laughs> well, since you tipped, uh, no. <laughs> All right. Candy, man. I don't want this candy. It's kind of weird that they give you a... I never eat them. Arms that gets thrown out in life. I, I've never eaten them. So I'm sure the kids love them. I don't know. Put it in your... Uh, put it in your Coke. You can my Coke. Actually, I could probably put it in this be just fine. It's already cherry. Peppermint cherry, make it Christmas. Good. Want to go to the Sonic I was at? Here's the address. It's backwards. Oh, it is? Yeah, you're oh, muted. I didn't flip it. It's all right. <laughs> they can, uh, they can just flip it on their screen. Well, I mean, when I'm sitting doing everything, it's all good anyways, but I guess I'm killing something. But, yeah, yeah, it's flipped. It's fine. Nobody cares. Just uh, hold this up. When you watch the video, just hold it up to the mirror, and you'll see where I'm at. Yeah. All right. Well, I think we'll call this one. It was good. It served oh, yeah. our fatness well. And... um. <laughs> And I'm stuffed because I actually ate everything. You ate everything too, right? Oh, I ate it all, yeah. yeah. There's nothing left. So, all right. Uh, be sure to subscribe, share with your friends and family, comment below, let us know how we're doing. And we will see you on the next episode. Stay fat. Yeah, man. Two fat J's, man. Stay fat.